Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for um, the third week, the third week of October. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Alrighty, Librans, Librans, we're working down. This is actually your last week. There's um, two more days after it, but this is actually deliverance last week of your zodiac energy vibration so happy birthday this reading is for the deliverance from the 14th until the 20th 14 until the 20th of um of the year um 2018 and uh, 19 i want to say and something is happening um Librans, go back and look at the weekly, weekly reading for your birthday last year um, because something happens to you in 2018 that is going to have a, an effect on you in um, this coming here, okay? So whatever it is and whatever that was transpiring, go back and look at uh, your birthday readings. Um, there's no on demand for your birthday readings, but go back and look at your birthday readings for last year because obviously um, there is some situation that is transpiring and is coming up. This is going to be a beautiful, beautiful um, week, um, um, year for you guys. Um, because what is happening and what is transpiring for you guys is that there is changes that is coming up and these changes are going to be extremely good okay these changes was meant to be that is coming up for you librans okay so um whatever is transpiring in this hair i'm seeing that you guys are going to be just cleaning shifting there's something that is happening with the lovers okay there is definitely that is something that is happening so you could be getting divorced you could be having issues with your partner that is definitely going to be coming up because as I'm going through this and this is why I'm doing this like this because we're going through and we're checking out and we're looking and we're trying to figure out what is going to be happening and transpiring. So ladies and gentlemen, life is about to change and life is about to change for a lot of you guys out there. Okay, this is a year where changes is coming in for you guys. All of you that was waiting for changes is definitely going to be coming in. All of you that wanted to move on, leave things behind you, work on other things, uh, um, better yourself in whatever way. All of you that was hoping for things um, to leave your life that no longer serve you, this is going to be happening for you guys, okay? So it is going to be a, a, a beautiful year and you're just starting the year 2019. Whatever is transpiring, you're just starting the year 2019, okay? So right after your birthday, that is when you begin the year 2019 and you need to understand this because a lot of people are not aware that you don't start the new year when the, the first of january because you weren't born um in the month of january you were born later on in the year okay um so what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring is that we're definitely definitely going to be finding out uh, and working on the shift of energies that is coming in working on the shift of energies that is coming in because a lot of shift of energies is coming in okay so let's go in this and let's see what is coming out remember there is going to be issues that is going to be coming up um with relationship in this year for you guys and i'm seeing really a lot of changes that is coming in so if you were born from the 14th of October, 14th of October until the 20th of October, this is your year 2019 energy vibration. Please remember that we have um, birthday readings and with the birthday readings, what happened and what transpired with birthday readings is that they show you in bold to bold every month what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring okay so the birthday reading show you bowl to bowl every month what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring okay as we can see your year is going to be a beautiful year because there's transition transition that is coming in for you guys there's a lot of transition that is coming in for you guys so as we look at the people who were born on the 14 the energy of the sun the people on the 15 your materialistic stability is going to be good 
the energy of transition is coming in for the people who were born on the 16 the people on the 17 is going to be a very lucky year. the people on the 18 spirituality secrets information is going to be coming out you could be bringing out this information the people on the 19 um yes yeah, spiritual awakening is coming in for the people on the 18 and 19 people on the 20 organization institute see you're going to be having luck if you're a lawyer it could be your lucky year justice you guys have justice as the center and as i had said before while I was going through the deck, as I have said before, a lot of stuff that was holding you back, the energy of the tower is coming down. A lot of stuff that was holding you back, the energy of the tower is coming down in this year. So right after your birthday. So here it is. If your birthday is from the 14th until the 20th, right the day after your birthday, you're going to be seeing that things are clearing up. Things are happening for you. Things are that was out of balance is coming in balance. Things are definitely happening. Things are pushing forward because this energy of the tower is that you liberants are going to be breaking and removing what no longer serves you. And this is going to be beautiful. Okay. This is really going to be beautiful. So, um, very, very positive energy that is coming in. There's an energy, there's uh, um, <laughs> I, someone that was lurking behind here that wants to receive a message. If you're in a relationship with this person, there is a lot. You could be getting married to this person. This person could be helping you out financially. Um, um, this person you could be, um, so it's going to be a lot of, um, other energies that you're dealing with this person in whatever way you're dealing with this person. This person is coming up. This could be a son. This could be someone who you have worked with someone who is there for you. So whatever the issue is, whatever the situation is, whatever that is transpiring, the energy of this person is coming up and is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. A Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. I'm seeing victory and success is coming for you guys. Okay, I was th thinking about using another deck. I might use another deck. Victory and success is coming up and it's uh, working for you guys. It's going to be a wonderful year. It's going to be a very, very wonderful year and a positive alignment of energy. I'm going to do another reading for you. I'm going to do a little bonus reading for you guys. I just think that you guys deserve it. I love you, Librans. Um, please um, share, share, share these videos for other people who are not aware of these videos. Please share, share, share these videos. This is the birthday for the Librans. 14 um 14 october until 20 october so for the people who were born on the 14th of october this year is going to be a very successful year for you if you were especially with prob uh, with family very successful you could be getting married you could be having your own family if you had um whatever secrets family secrets there were it's going to be coming out whatever family secrets there were it's going to be coming out but happiness and joy is coming back in the family um, whatever secrets, whatever situation that was going on, I'm seeing some of you are going to be re um, receiving the psychic information that is coming in for you. This is going to be wonderful. It's going to be very positive. So accept this energy. I'm seeing positive alignment of energy success for you people that was born under 14. If you had issues, health issues, this is going to be good. Your energy is going to be a balancing back in a positive vibration. It's going to be a very, very powerful year right after your birthday to to 2020. Um, you're going to be feeling good family issues and situation is going to be cleared up. The truth came out and for the people, we're moving to the people who were born on the um, 15th. Um, you guys are going to be seen very, very clearly. You women is as if the universe has opened up and removed the veil of illusions. Okay. Especially the women, it will happen to the men, but especially for the women is as if the universe has opened up and, um, is, um, really, 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 um, showing you 
and giving you clarity to something that you weren't aware of okay it's, it's, it's as if you have 2020 vision enjoy it in this year it's as if you have 2020 vision enjoy it in this year for the men who was born on the 15th your financial stability is going to be good if you have a business your business is going to be taken off it's going to be fastness fast fast things are happening fastness are happening if you're looking for work there is just going to be um an energy of just wonderful possibility of situation that is going to be coming up so you people who were born on the 15 is as if you're going to be having 2020 vision right from after your birthday to your next zodiac birthday in 2020 it's as if you're having 2020 vision everything is going fast everything is going fast everything that you want is falling into place things are just going fast and everything is going to be um, right in time number eight some of you are going to be very financial stable okay it's like um, um, new jobs new promotion new jobs all of that sort of a thing is coming up for you guys and this is just so going to be so good so powerful so wonderful that what is happening and transpiring a transition is coming in for the people who were born on the 16th um, and this is going to be good this transition that is going in and that is coming in for you guys were meant to come in okay the transition that is coming in for you guys were meant to come in because what is happening and what is transpiring is that you guys were going through some negative um situation in your life and now you are definitely bringing these issues and situation um to an end and this is going to be good because you are finding that things are going to be um um happening very fastly okay so um it is going to be um so wonderful so you gotta be aware of this and understand what is happening and what is transpired okay it is going to be powerful because you're shifting your energies for the people who were born on the 16. You're helping the rest of people also to shift their energies. So um, this is going to be wonderful. It's going to be excited. It's going to be a time of changes. Changes is going to be coming in and you are going to be so aligned with the right energies and the right situations that is happening. Okay. So the people on the 16, I love this year for you guys. It's going to be a beautiful year. It's going to be a wonderful alignment of energies that is coming up and it's going to be transforming your world like your world has never been transformed before. Okay. So so this is um, definitely, definitely going to be so good for you guys. You're going to be so aligned with the energies that is happening. Okay, so this is um, really a positive, positive alignment of energies for you guys. This is just so positive. It's, it's coming up with so many positive alignments of energy and this is going to be good. Okay. So I'm, I'm, I'm really, really, really loving this um, for you guys. The, these are just vital energies that is coming in for the people on the 16 with all these wonderful alignment of energies that is coming in. That is so wonderful because you're, you're basically vibrating with the positive energies and this is going to be good let's see what else is coming out for the people who were born on the 16th and remember a birthday readings is always good okay so money is going to be coming in for you guys the transition so if there was um if for you people uh, the 16 and the rest of you because um this is it whatever that was blocking your financial flow for all of you out there, whatever that was blocking your financial flow, a transition is going to be coming in. It's going to affect the people who are born from the 16th to the 20th because it's crowning your year. So that means this is one of the energy that is going to be lifted. So whatever was blocking your financial situation for the people who are born on the 16th, you are actually helping the rest of the people to remove those um, blockages that was there. Okay now 
um, for the people who were born on the 17, what we have here is that uh, the Wheel of Fortune is bringing you ideas, new ideas, new information that is going to be helping you. Now, if you're a lawyer and you were born on... 17th of uh, October. Now your practice or you are going to be extremely, extremely good with your job because what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring is that you're going to be seen the, um, beyond the illusion. So if you're a lawyer and you were born on the 17th of October, you're going to be seen uh, um, beyond the illusions. You're going to be winning cases like you have never won um, before. Um, but for everyone, this is going to be a year where you're going to be seeing how to make extra money. Things are going to be things that you weren't seeing clearly is going to become clearly. Um, you're protecting yourself. You're protecting everything around you and you're standing up and you're showing, um, and seeing what is coming for you. You're going to be having these moments where you're getting these ideas, how, um, to make money. Okay. It's a twi twice the Empress comes up. So a lot of you are going to be very, very, um, mature and very, very nurturing to others. And this is good. As we look at the people who were born on the 18, we're seeing the energy of the moon. Now this is a very psychic moon. This is not, um, deceptive people. This is a very psychic moon. And from out of your vision, you're going to be finding out how to deal with certain situation and certain issues. Some of you, especially you ladies are dealing with a, um, uh, a scorpion. Some of you ladies are going to be dealing with a scorpion. Okay. You, so if you were born on the 18th of uh, October, you're going to be dealing with a scorpion and you're going to be seeing the truth about the scorpion. Some of you are scorpion, some of you are cancer, but the truth, the lies, whatever the scorpion was hiding from you is going to be coming out. Okay. So you lay this, it can be a child. It can be your partner, whoever, but, um, especially the ladies, the men is uh, not going to be that clear, but for the ladies, you're going to be finding out something about a scorpion. Some of you men are going to be having regrets going in a relationship with a scorpion and a cancer. So some of you men are going to be having regrets going in a relationship with a scorpion and a cancer. It could be that divorce could be coming up because I'm seeing you protecting yourself. Okay. So divorce could be coming up now for the people who are born on the 19th, you are going to be cutting through the BS because you're seeing the truth. The people who were born on the 19th of, uh, um, October is going to be cutting through the BS because you have seen the truth, the truth about a cancer, the truth about something that was taken from you that was not uh, that that people the lies and deception that people and situation with the organization you're going to be seeing the truth and you're going to be taking this out for the people who were born on the 20th i'm seeing that a legal issue you're going to be saddened by this legal issue and you're going to decide to walk away i'm seeing that you're asking um um, it could be, um, the energy of a Pisces in an organization. Some of you are dealing with a Pisces in an organization and heartbreak is coming up. I'm seeing a legal, um, a, a legal issue, but you're not going to win this legal issue. You liberal. I'm sorry to say that here is a heartbreak and the legal issue. So whatever has happened and whatever has transpired, especially with legal issue that is coming up, there's heartbreak. There's definitely heartbreak because I'm seeing people. I'm seeing people that is all around here. There's sadness. So whatever, I think now the truth is coming out. People are seeing the truth, especially in an organization that some of you were dealing with the Pisces, uh, um, in an organization and uh, this, um, Pisces or this person or whoever you were dealing with in this organization, I'm seeing some of you having heartbreaks and walking away from an organization. It's as if this organization has let you fall. And it's okay because 
um, it is as if in this year, this is a year that balance, balance is the focus of this year. Balance is the focus of this year. So whatever is happening, do not worry about it because if you need to leave a company, if you need to walk away from a company, if there is injustice in balance, because I'm seeing that, um, it's as if communication, but some of you are going to be cutting out something that is happening. There was a lot of secrets that was, um, going on around you guys. A lot of information is going to be coming out. These secrets is about money. You're trying to protect yourself and your financial, um, there is going to be some heartbreaks, but you're going to be cutting the BS out. Okay. You guys are definitely going to be cutting the BS out. It's a year where information is going to be coming in because light is going to be shed on secrets, lies, and deception. There is twice the energy of the hermit. So endings are going to be coming in because some of you could be working with the an organization and wasn't aware that this organization was illegally using your information or has illegally used your information. They found out what has transpired. So if the ending with your work in an organization, it's time to move on. It's time to move on. I'm seeing some of you are just going to be moving on from an organization. What is also coming up is that materialistic success is going to be here for you guys. So money is going to be coming in. If your money was blocked, it's going to come in. A lot of people are seeing the truth about the family issue, the world and the situation that is going on with the energy of the hermit. The truth is coming out about a situation. There will be some sadness about a, a scorpion. And I'm seeing some of you turning your back on a scorpion and, and moving forward because secrets are going to be coming out. You could be turning your back on your partner. Secrets are definitely going to be coming out. I'm seeing you being offered something, but I'm seeing some of you is like, no, that is not what I'm supposed to have. I need to have my this or that. Okay. And you need to speak up for yourself. Um, some of you might receive an offer that you're thinking, yeah, this offer doesn't really do me anything. Um, for all the distress and pain that I've gone through. No, I'm not accepting that. Okay. So that is coming up. Okay. Wonderful, wonderful energies, wonderful, um, positive situations that is going to be aligned. And, um, let's see, um, what else is coming up for you guys in this year. Remember ask for a birthday reading. It's never too late. Cause I, I can go back and recalculate what is going to be coming out for you guys. There's a lot of message. Um, there are a lot of message and a lot of businesses are going to be good. Okay. So I'm going to do the two cards, um, to see what is better. Um, two cards. I haven't done this in quite a while. This is the first card. This is the second card. Choose one of these cards. If you choose the first card, it says patient. I accept that everything happens in divine timing. Okay. So some of you could be waiting very patient or it's going to be waiting very patient in order for something to happen in the divine timing. Judgment comes up. If you choose the second card, it's judgment. And it says, I understand that everything as their own unique part and challenges everything of their own unique part and challenges. Okay. So, um, this is uh, what is coming up for you guys. So I want to say, please uh, order a, a birthday reading or a year reading, because this is going to, um, advise you and give you more information about what is happening, what is about to happen. I want to say namaste until next time.